how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. So today I wanted to do a tag video with y'all. With y'all. Um, this tag was uh, created and made by Laura from Laura's Shake Up Your Makeup channel. If you are not subscribed to her, I will have a link to her channel and all that down below. So if you want to, you can go check her out, share some love and subscribe so much appreciate that and she is such a gem of a lady i love watching her she has her roses and thorns every um every week and yeah i just i love watching her she's very creative when it comes to her videos and everything too so hopefully at some point i can become as creative and um get to learn more on certain new techniques and everything um so yeah, this is going to be called Shake Up, Shake Up My Life. So yeah, there shake. is ten questions, and there was quite a few of us that she tagged us, tagged us to do this. So I'm going to go ahead and go with the, get into it. <laughs> so question number one: What is one makeup product that you that can shake up your look? Um. For me, I had thought about that when I had heard that question. I would probably have to say for me, it would be the eyebrows. I feel like I lack on the eyebrows still. Um, it's still a learning process. It's still a, a, a constant battle with them. So I need a lot more um, in depth and learn a little more about the brows and that. I mean, I kind of know, I know that, but uh, I feel like I, I do and I don't. Number two, what could you do to change up your hair, color, style, products, etc.? <sighs> Probably for me, I'm looking into, like, my hair is very long and I love my long hair. I mean, I do love. I do love having long hair, but it is probably the longest it's been in a long, long time because it's nearly like down to the middle of my back. No joke. Uh, well, obviously you can see how long it is here, so it, it's very long. I'm not talking about getting it cut and like having this short bob haircut, and I'm not talking about getting it cut and having it being shorter length, neither. <laughs> I'm not ready for all that kind of stuff right now. Um, I move myself around here and there. Um, for a short bob haircut, mm, I definitely don't see that anywhere in the near future for me. I just don't like short hair on me. It's just no for me. Um, so that is not going to happen until gosh knows when. I have no idea. So what I would like is getting some long layers done up and um you know just retexturize it and kind of get the um the damaged part of the hair like the split ends and whatever uh, get those things all trimmed up and the other thing i was thinking about doing for color is i was thinking of doing something with caramel coloring in my hair not making my whole hair a caramel color I don't know if I'd like that, but I did get like where I had a uh, chocolate brown hair with caramel highlights or something like that before. So I'm thinking somewhere in that neck of the woods, but I don't know. You never know with me. I can change my mind because I mostly go for the red hues and brown hues. Like I don't go too extreme for the red. Uh, orange red, mm, I don't think that would look good on me, but could be wrong, but I just don't think that would look good on me. I, I'm just thinking somewhere there, maybe. I don't know. Thoughts, anyhow. Definitely the haircut, yeah, like the long layer kind of thing going on. Uh, number three, what new skin care treatment or product would you like to try? Um, new skincare treatment or product I would like to try. Hmm. I would probably, there's several, there's a couple companies 
of skincare I wouldn't mind trying, but they're kind of on the pricey uh, range. Um, I definitely really like El Generous, the El Generous company. I love that oil. Uh, some of the other products that I've tried I have really liked. And I believe they have some kind of new peel out right now, some kind of uh, face peel kind of a thing. I'm not sure. I have to look and see. <laughs> but it, it, it was it sounded interesting. I uh, probably probably like something to them reference. Uh, and the Tachia, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, the Tachia, I wouldn't mind trying some of their. Some of their products. I like I liked the cleansing oil. I had tried that. That was pretty good. I pretty good cleansing oil. I liked it really well. Um, so I'm kind of interested in trying some more of their products out. Um, number four. What unexpected clothing item or accessory could you add to your collection? Um, probably more scarves for accessories, definitely. Um, I have lacked on a lot of jewelry. I mean, I know sometimes you'll see me wearing jewelry and I, like, I have this bracelet and wear my rings and stuff. But I would like to get um, some more jewelry pieces, more statement pieces and stuff like that. Um, I'm starting to get into that myself. And scarves, those two things for accessories. Um, for clothing... Gosh, I'm trying to think for clothing. Um, because I have a lot of cardigan jacket kind of things and cover things, and I got lots of t shirts and tank tops and um, dressy tops and non dressy. I, I don't know for clothing. That's a good one. I don't know. Hmm. I can't think of anything for that one. Uh, number five, what area in your home would you like to restyle from finishing touches to a full renovation? Can we just talk about this room here for one would be a nice one, which don't mind. My son just got home from his army reserves that he was in Wisconsin. So, uh, that's his bag back there that you'll see. So he hasn't fully unpacked everything, but, uh, this room definitely... But, uh, but then again, if we were talking renovation, I would probably say my kitchen or my bathroom. Because both of them really need a nice, good renovation. Yeah. I mean, this is a really good house. It's a really nice house. It really needs a lot of touch-ups and a lot of good things. And it, and it, will be, it would be amazing. Um, just amazing. But... Um, there's just a lot of things that need done, and when we first moved here, it was like, I think all our money invested in putting new wiring and plumbing and all that stuff, and by the time we're all set, it's like, mm, yeah, yeah. So, and that could be very pricey, you know. So yeah, it would probably be my, the kitchen or the bathroom. Uh, six. It's time to get on the road. Where will you spend the day that is new to you? Oh, spend the day. So just the day? Where would you spend the day that's new to you? You know what? I know exactly where. But I'm trying to think of where it's at here in Pennsylvania. And Natalie, the beauty diva, is going to know exactly what I'm talking about. And it was... Um, Terra, it's it's a place where it's like almost like, or like, it's a whole model almost of like Terra from the movie. It's a huge mansion, breakfast and bed place, and they have rooms named like ones named um, uh, Rhett Butler and um, God, I can't even think of half their names right now. And Scarlet, you know, um, so. Yeah, I'd probably go, I'm not sure where that's at. Or, uh, and the two orchids would know this place. The other place would be Grove City Outlets. Definitely is another one. Between Grove City Outlets and then Terra. Oh, I showed Natalie a picture of that. And, oh my gosh, that place just looks amazing. I would love to go there for just the day. And, oh. 
Um, number seven. What new activity would you like to try with family member or friend? New activity I would like to try. Mm -hmm. New activity. Gosh. I'm a person that likes to venture and go places like I was talking about, you know, like terror and stuff like that. Uh, and I, I like a lot. I like to learn and know a lot of history, historic things. So maybe that. Maybe get together every so often and go to all these different historical places and venture and that kind of thing. Ooh, I know too because I like the whole ghost hunter stuff. You know me, ghost adventures, ghost hunter. Yeah, do that. That would be an activity I want to do. Go on a ghost hunter adventure kind of a thing. What if Zach Beggins and I would invite me or something like that? That'd be pretty awesome. I'd be, I'd be game. He can send me in them rooms and sit in that room alone, and I'd be game for that. Yeah. Um. Okay. What food would you indulge in that you've never had before? Oh, gosh. I've never had before. I just thought of something. Baklava. Sounds and looks so awesomely good. Baklava. I want baklava. That just... <clears throat> okay. So there we go, baklava. <laughs> uh, nine, how would you change up your fitness activity? <laughs> well, probably wouldn't want to indulge in baklava then. <laughs> um, mm, a lot. A whole renovation of a fitness activity for sure because, I mean, I barely get too much fitness in and it's terrible. But a lot of times, I mean, like I walk. I get a lot of walking in and move around. It's not that. It's just, um, I was the person that, I mean, like, I literally, um, walked, like, all the time. I, I wouldn't say every single day, but I was on this thing where I was walking every so many times in a week. I would do it after dinner, not, like, right after. Obviously, let my stomach rest for about an hour and then go out. And, um... Yeah, it just it was it felt so good doing that, and when my legs just kind of went downhill, um, that's when things started going more downhill for me from just that alone, and then my eating habit got bad, and hey, you know, uh, nobody but to blame myself. So, but um, yeah, I, there would be a lot. Uh, I'm hoping at some point I can get that motivation. It's, you, you, you need to get that motivation in you somewhere, and, because I've been there, done that a couple times, and I know what it feels like, um, so I, I need to get that back, definitely, so just everything, oops, uh, number 10, what store would you purchase from that you've never shopped at before, hmm, that I've never shopped I mean, at I've before. shopped at uh, quite a few stores online. So I'm not sure if it means if it means going to a store that I've never been to before. I can now say I've been to a Sephora, but I was in one in J.C. Penney. I wasn't into an actual full-on Sephora store, so that would be awesome. Um, and I've never been in an Alta, so Alta would be another one. But um, if we went by online and going Nordsh Nor Nor Nordstrom's Nordstrom's she can't say it so that is it that is the 10 questions <laughs> can't believe I struggled at some of those that was crazy but I did I think some of them were kind of pretty tough tough to think of and answer and that so all right beauty so that's the questions those were the 10 questions so if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up. I would so much appreciate it. It would help me out a lot. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, I would so love to have you. So go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. Come join me each week. And um, yeah, just stick around for a while. I'd love to have you. 
And as always, beauties, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. Until next time.